project is very important and it's important for FAO as well as for Tanzania. The project has been chosen for a reason and it's to uh, rehabilitate the mangroves which are degraded and we all know how important are the mangroves in terms of combating climate change, in terms of preserving the fishing site and the breeding site for the fish. Ukiangalia mikoko ni mimea ambayo mara zote inabaki na majani haipokutishi majani kama miti mingine. Kwa namna hiyo ina uwezo mkubwa sana wa kupunguza ewa ukaa kwenye mazingira na namna hiyo kupunguza ile ongezeko la joto ambayo linasababisha mabadiliko ya tabia nchi. Kiukweli kama wakazi wa mji huu tulipata asali kubwa sana kitendo cha kukata hii mikoko, kifikia hatua tunakosa mvua na kosa baadhi yani samaki wanashindwa kuzaliana halmashauri kwa kusaidiana na jamii husika na serikali za mtaa itaunda timu ambayo itakuwa karibu zaidi na wananchi karibu zaidi na eneo hili kwa ajili ya kuwezesha uoteshaji zaidi wa mikoko hii ili tuweze kurudisha mazingira ambayo yameharibika yawe katika hali, hali yake ya kawaida so the progress needs commitment from technical support which we are doing, financial support to make sure that we scale it up to other locations which have not been uh, taken, taken care of yet, and also commitment from the community to make sure that whatever we have planted, for it to be sustained, it needs to be protected. So it needs commitment from all of us. I see a lot of progress. I am very hopeful that it will succeed in the coming years. In 10 years to come, I'm sure this place will be forested if we all commit ourselves to address the challenges.